So my name is Mi Chang and I live in St. Paul. So um, I grew up in St. Paul for a long time. So the one fact, or if someone didn't know me, I would say that I, I love public transportation. I love, um, I love community gardening and then I just really enjoy um, spending time outdoors in mother nature, but also spending time with my family. So I was a participant in one of the action planning workshop um, two years ago. And I was really intrigued by the method that I was a participant of. And so um, in my job, we do a lot of facilitation and um, my supervisor recommended that um, I signed up for a class. So I did a three day class a year ago. I did. I really wanted to build on that skill set. And so I thought that the mastery cohort class would be a good way to build on to uh, my to build onto my skills that I've learned in that three-day class. I think it's really helped me think about the conversations that I will be having, um, designing it, uh, thinking about how it's gonna flow. But then I think in general, this has really helped me build up um, how I set my meetings. Um, how do I make it more efficient to get things done in a limited time? that I often call on leaders to come to a meeting. Um, I think it's really important to use that time wisely. And so um, it's really changing the way we meet uh, to make it more actionable, to make it more participatory. But I think in general, to have a sense um, of accomplishment after we're done meeting. I think in 10 years um, that the skills that I've learned um, here will be just natural, that I wouldn't be thinking about the process of how I got to my meetings or the process or the design, but that the skill sets are naturally embedded in what I do. So it'll be, um, I think I hope to see it as a, just living it out in um, naturally and embedded in the way I think and in the way in the conversations that I have. Now, I think this method, the top method, is really unique. And um, I get really excited sharing it with others. Um, I don't talk about the technical aspect of it, but I do love sharing the ideas and the concepts in small pieces for people who are new and are looking for a different way to run their meetings. And so I think I get really excited about sharing that knowledge with someone else um, just because I think um, as emerging leaders, um, you want to feel confident. And I think being able to share the knowledge to pass it on to someone else to make their work more efficient and effective is always a win-win. I think some, you know, this method, the connection part, it really draws out the best ideas because it is inclusive, uh, inclusive and participatory that the ideas and the actions and the results that come out of a meeting are really, um, are, they're developed by the people. And so as a facilitator, I'm not going into a meeting with a preconceived solution, but the solutions are made by the people in the group. And so I think that um, that really helps with commitment, that really helps with um, a sense of empowerment that because they've themselves created that solution, it's really theirs to own and not me as the facilitator.